Hey babies, like I said, we are back on a video. This is a freestyle. Hey! <laughs> Alright you guys, so the stuff I'll be using right here is some Queen Bee pre-stretch hair in the color 1B. A rat tail comb, as you can see in my hand. Then we're going to come in with some Shining Jam, the illustrious Shining Jam. Yes ma'am, extra hold, you know the vibe. And last but not least, my Red One Aqua Wax, which is the plug.com. If you don't have this product in your stock, you better get it. So y'all, I already pre-parted the parts for the freestyle braids. So I'm kind of doing like a zigzag kind of part in the back. So I'm just going to show you guys how I already zigzag parted it out. Like I said, this is a freestyle. So I had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> so I had this random idea to do zigzag parting half up, half down kind of style. But I wanted it to be unique. So let's get into this style. I'm going to go ahead by parting it down the middle. So each zigzag, I'm going to part a section down the middle. So right here, I'm just making sure that my part is clean before I go in. And then I'm going to tuck away the other side that I'm not going to be getting to as yet. Yes, ma'am. Now let's move right along. Y'all know how we do with the shine and jam. We apply that on both sides of the braid section. Yes, ma'am. And then I go and I reapply with some wax. My aqua wax that I showed you guys in the beginning of the video. Yes, baby. This is what lays it all together, okay? After that, I go in with my rat tail comb and I try to comb in the product through the hair just to make sure that it's smooth, it's flat, and it's neat. I also adjust my parting if need be. So I am going to be doing stitch braids on my client. So what I'm going to do is take a small section out and I'm going to split that section into three. I'm going to let you guys watch me braid this first braid and how I stitch it and then I'm going to explain just so it'll be easier for some of the visual learners. This process might be easier for you to understand. So go ahead and watch this and then we're going to get straight into the detail, the breakdown on how to do these stitch braids. Okay? Yes. <laughs> the first red is looking after i finish this is so sleek so pretty oh my god i wish you guys could actually see but there's like a reflection so it doesn't look how it looks but you're gonna see eventually how it looks you feel me so let's get into the second braid i'm gonna go ahead and start by parting down the middle like i said wherever the point of each zigzag is i will part a line down the middle and that will create my row for braiding i always go in with my shining jam first put that down yes ma'am take my rat tail comb and we're gonna go back into that scalp and make sure that part comes out clean okay 
if it's not clean, then the braids do not look good. Oh my God. Yes. So we have to make sure we have clean parts, okay? So, yeah, get into it. Right here, we finna bust it wide open. Then we tell her, bring it back. Bust bu bu it wide open. Okay, y'all, I'm a TikTok fan. Anywho, I split that section in three. And then I go ahead and braid down once. And then twice. And now I'm gonna take my wrap tail comb and I'm gonna part out a really small stitch. And I'm gonna add that to my two fingers there. You see my first finger and my bottom finger. I slipped it right in between those fingers. And then I take a small piece of the braiding here and I braid it in. I also leave one strand out and I continue to braid down. Then I stitch with my other hand. Notice I don't use a comb for this side. This is how I learned to stitch. Then I braid it down and I grab the other piece of hair and I insert it in between my thumb and pointer finger. I go ahead and create another stitch and I do the same method. Grab a small piece of hair I'm going to attach it, braid down, flip up, then I'm going to braid down again, then create another stitch. Yes, ma'am. Braid down again, and then I'm going to flip it and tuck it, and then we are going to braid down again and create another stitch. It's the same pattern, and then twice. And now I'm gonna take my wrap tail comb and I'm gonna part out a really small stitch and I'm gonna add that to my two fingers there. You see my first finger and my bottom finger. I slipped it right in between those fingers. And then I take a small piece of the braiding here and I braid it in. I also leave one strand out and I continue to braid down. Then I stitch with my other hand. Notice I don't use a comb for this side. This is how I learned to stitch. Then I braid it down and I grab the other piece of hair and I insert it in between my thumb and pointer finger. I go ahead and create another stitch and I do the same method. Grab a small piece of hair. I'm gonna attach it, braid down, flip up. Then I'm going to braid down again then create another stitch yes ma'am braid down again and then I'm gonna flip it and tuck it and then we are going to braid down again and create another stitch it's the same pattern all the way through so just follow those steps and I'm pretty sure you're gonna get it come through days look at this unique gang what do you guys think so far yes boom on to the next Yes, so the first stitch, as you guys can see, I put it in between my pointer finger and thumb. Hopefully you guys can see it more clearly at this angle. I go ahead and insert the hair, bring it down. I left one piece out and then I bring it down again. Then I take my pinky and I go ahead and create another stitch. Once I do that, I go ahead and bring it down again, flip the piece into my thumb and pointer finger go ahead and create another stitch using the comb and repeat this pattern y'all i'm going to be saying this more than once but it's the same routine it's the same routine just keep watching babies keep watching let's see how this style turns out
hair you can see me stitching a lot clearer as I braid down yes I braid kind of funny I'm I'm right-handed but I have left-handed tendencies <laughs> yes I am ambidextrous but anywho watch me stitch the rest of this braid we are looking good honey so I go ahead and I braid down and then I'm going to grab my comb and just comb this product through just to make sure it's flat create another stitch yes bam then I'm going to go in with some extension here yes yes look at the stitches and we are going to braid it down you see how I'm gripping tightly you see that yes ma'am it's so beautiful look at you go days look at that now I'm not the best at doing stitch braids but baby I am learning and while I'm learning I am seeing progress Believe it or not, when I first learned how to stitch, it was not this flat and it was not this perfect. Like, baby, I'm getting it together. And we, y'all are going to see my progress. Pro I can't even so speak, but y'all are going to see my progress on this journey, okay? Yes. Just wait on it. Just, just wait on it. Let's get a close up because I need y'all to see these visuals. I need y'all to see these fingers go to work, honey. They are gonna go to work. Work it like I do. Gonna twerk it like I do. Something like I do. Or whatever Chloe or Hallie or whatever, uh, whoever it is said. Yeah, we're gonna see these fingers work it like I do. <laughs> Now, now, sisters and brothers, I don't got Megan Thee Stallion knees, but baby, I sure do got Megan Thee Stallion knuckles because, honey, <laughs> let me tell you, I put these ain't no art. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you see that grip, baby? The, you, you see that grip? You gotta got some strong knuckles for these. <laughs> Y'all know I don't use any heat, so baby, I gotta have some strong fingers to be gripping those roots. Uh -huh. Now, we ain't pulling out no hair, y'all. She is very comfortable in that seat. She is not squinching. You can watch her eyes. Look at her eyes. She's not squinching at me. Bring her hair. I braid very soft. But yes, hunty. We got the Megan Stallion knuckles, okay? Y'all see that? Knuckles. Did that. Yes. Do you, do you see? Do you? Child. Now, let's work on the top. So, first off, I'm going to start by creating a circle in the middle of her scalp. That's going to be for a very large center knotless braid because like I said, the top half is going to be a ponytail. So let's get into this ponytail baby. If y'all don't know how to start a knot, let's braid by now, baby. What is you doing? You ain't learned nothing from my channel. But anywho, as you guys see, I separated the braid into three sections. And then I started braiding down. Yes, ma'am. So we're going to braid it down a little bit. Braid it, braid it, braid it. Yes, make sure the hair is smooth while you are braiding so you don't get any lumps and bumps. And baby, we add in some extensions. And you continue to braid that down. Then you go ahead and you add some more extension, baby. You braid it down two more times. Okay, sis? Let's go. One, two, and baby, three. Let's go. Then we added some more extension. Now, I don't have a limit on how much time I braid down before I add in. I do what feels right to maintain the thickness of the braid. Okay, child? Now, let's skip ahead. Okay? Okay. Yes, because we like them thick. Ooh, wee. Yes, darling. Now we on to the top. I already sectioned it out. As you guys can see, we already parted those parts so we can braid this point. So, baby, let me tell you, when I finish this style, they're going to be like, whoa, did you just do that? Because, yes, I did. We just we just did that. Okay, right? So, let's, you see, she already feeling herself in the chair. But, yes, let's, let's, let's get to bring this point to y'all. Help me. 
through you made it through we at the end of the video baby we coming through results is coming up next so baby stay tuned for this last braid i just need y'all to see how i finish prepping these braids and i'm done and then baby you're gonna see the results so stay tuned stay tuned thank you for watching i appreciate your support to my little small youtube channel if you are part of the unique gang already i appreciate you so 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 much y'all don't even know y'all don't know Thank you guys for being here. And if you are new, make sure you subscribe and join the Unique Gang. We appreciate new followers over here, new subscribers. We love you. Just join the crew. And without further ado, let's hop right back into this video. <laughs> That's my baby, y'all. Look at her. I already feel herself and ain't even finished yet. <laughs> All right, babe, Brayden is done. Now let's add a pop of color, babies. And boom. Blasting a little free spray on the scalp, making it shiny and making it stain no flyaways, baby. Then I got the blow dry, we blow dry like so, like that, like Top of the Brown says in her videos. Yes, baby. <laughs> How y'all feeling about these rays? Let me know in the comment section. I did that, y'all. Let me know what you guys think about this zigzag stitch braid with a pop of color ponytail you feel me y'all see my little turtles in the background yeah that's my babies anywho let's just focus on this style though like come all the way through yes thank you guys so much for watching if you watch this all the way through i love you so much make sure you like comment share subscribe